So we have a flag day sensor in Home Assistant. It is right here. We are checking using the REST API to see whether today is a flag day. And if it is, we're gonna color the house red, white, and blue. Let me show you how I do it. Hey everyone, I just wanted to make a video on my flag sensor. So it was President's Day a couple days ago and I noticed the house was lit up red, white, and blue. Um, so I wanted to show you how I'm doing that uh, in YAML in Home Assistant. So let's jump to the computer screen and let me show you what I'm doing. I was actually just listening to the HA podcast. If you haven't subscribed to that or if you don't listen to that, uh, it's great. Every, every, every two weeks uh, when there's a release for Home Assistant, Bohan and Phil get on there and they just do a, just a great job breaking down all the new features. So uh, check it out if you haven't. So for the colors of the front house, let's look at the YAML. I have a couple of automations, but the real one that I use is this sunset turn on. So basically the trigger is when the sun goes down, so sunset is occurring, run this script called, we do a bunch of things, but we really run this script called script monthly color scene. Now, if we look at that monthly color scene, what it does is there's a condition to make sure it only runs, basically just that it only runs when the sun is down. So it's nighttime basically. Uh, we then turn on a specific scene. So we can see here, we run scene month underscore. And then what we'll do is depending on the date or a sensor, uh, there's a video for the, there's a video for the, for the Valentine's day that you can see where I, I talk a little bit about this, that if it's a certain time, like in this case, it's February 10th to February 14th, we trigger Valentine, but for flag days, we do red, white, and blue. So President's Day and a couple other ones, we do red, white, and blue. So what we do here, you can see is there's a trigger that looks to make sure that the flag day sensor is true. Now, if we go to the holiday package, I have these open, what the flag sensor, and this is just a normal sensor, what this is a rest sensor actually. And what this rest sensor does is it looks at this URL, which that URL, it's a free URL. It goes to webcal.fi and pulls down a JSON file of all the current this year's flag holidays. So actually, so it actually uses these holidays. So these are the flag holidays for 2019. So this comes down in the JSON file you can see here, I dumped it into uh, sort of a JSON pretty fire. And what you can see is, let me scroll up to February. So what it'll do is you have just a JSON file of the date, the name, whether it's a flag day. In this particular case, this calendar that I'm pulling down with this URL, all of them are flag days. So I'm just, this is the flag day, um, this is the flag day calendar. So this is just, all of them will be there. So then what we do in our scripts is we basically, we look at today's date, then we evaluate the day val, the date. So we're looking at that JSON date and we're just comparing it with today. So if the date in JSON matches today's date, then we mark it as true. We mark the flag sensor as true. If not, we mark it as false. So then, in our script, which is here, what we're doing is we're saying, if the flag sensor is true, then I want you to run the RWB, the red, white, and blue scene, which if we look at over here, it's basically red, white, and blue colors. So that beginning script is month underscore, then based on the date we put in, like, you know, R RWB, or we put in the holiday, and then we end it with underscore color. So this way it always matches up. So for all of our instances, we're using red, white, and blue across. And I have some footage of what the house looks like that I'll show at the end. So this screen kicks off, and then this script continues, whoops, then the sunset script just continues on. But that's basically 
how I'm using the flag sensor uh, in home in in home assistant and we have here if you look we have this flag sensor and today today is not a flag day today it's showing up as false so the way that sensor works if I flip back the way the sensor works is it scans every uh, 14,400 seconds which is basically every six hours so four times a day it's going to pull this it's going to use the REST API, pull down that JSON file, do its comparison, and then either mark the flag sensor as true or false. Then when the monthly, when the sunset kicks in, it checks the monthly script and we see whether we have to color the house. Let's jump to the footage outside and you can see in action. Okay, take care. This is just red, white, and blue. President's Day. Really for any flag day.